And then, and then what? What happened? Oh, yes. And then a room opened up for two months. Mm hmm. June and July with free Fushiwa. Well, not Fu, just Shiwa. And I was on it. I have an apology to make. <laughs> well, f f for the audio first. And second, I have, uh, I made a comment about calling the buskers in Kingman aggressive. And first of all, they're not buskers because the busker corrected me and was offended. So I'm really sorry about that. Uh, but I just learned the word less than a year ago and I was copying what people were saying because I had never heard the word. I didn't know that. So buskers are people, I think, that exchange entertainment or something for donations. I don't know. So don't, I'm never going to use the word again, because I, I still don't think I know. Well, I see we all survived my uh, return video. <laughs> yeah, it was, a, it was really hard just capturing what April was, where I left you, and then um, the audio was Terrible. I know that you guys only heard half. But the choice to post and not post was like, I have to post. That's, that's it. Uh, it was good enough. So, um, and I did run out and buy a mic because I had three different mics. I was trying them all it, and they were terrible. So I went out and bought a brand new mic. And it was on sale, a hundred dollar one. I was using my PayPal line of credit, which you don't have to pay for six months. And so I had some left on that. I thought I'm going to buy a good mic, and I went and bought a really good mic. Brought it home. It was defective as far as attachment, and then it, it's it, it sounded like I was in a jail cell. So I was. I'm still having some troubles. It's great to hear from everybody and feel the love and the passion and the concern and. Um, I, I didn't, I didn't plan the break. It wasn't intended. I think some of you know that it was the bass and wife fishing part two video that took everything out, that loaded up my computer, didn't have an external hard drive, didn't have a backup, the cell phone stopped working, not stopped working, but I couldn't charge it. So now I'm using an old cell phone to charge the batteries and flip them. So there's, there's a lot of equipment issues. Don't have Wi-Fi, And uh, uh, I was just, it was like opening a restaurant with no equipment and, or not, <laughs> no way to turn it on. And uh, I just got tired of winging it. And I'm like, this is not working. It's not financially viable. I didn't need a $500 donation to, or $50 or 500. I, I need 5,000. So I just quit. I stopped and I was in the high deserts of Arizona and the, it was so beautiful. And I took a lot of time, made a lot of notes, worked on a, on, on a two and a half year plan and I have my Fushiwa covered. Yes, someone commented like, we should add that to the vernacular. Yes, I did make that up because food shelter water just sounds very clinical or something. And Fushiwa is just lighter. And I make up words all the time. So I hope you understand that it, it most of you could see that it wasn't working. But I just, it's just, it was just like my fibromyalgia and my sensory processing thing. Uh, I'm in denial of it all the time because I don't want things and I want to participate in life. And uh, I just can't deny that I, my disabilities prevent me from having the choices that many of you have. Don't feel sorry for me, don't. I'm good. I, I know that these things are to keep me focused on what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm not a victim of these things. Uh, these are guides in my life, and I'm healthier because of them. <laughs> so I really believe that, and you know that. Most of you do not know what it's like to feel inadequate, but I do. And I didn't need a break from YouTube. <laughs> I was forced to take it. 
I got tired of saying, I don't have this, I don't have this, I can't do that, you know, I don't have a generator, I don't have, you know, the, the solar power wasn't hooked up, mounted properly, you know. And I didn't have running water, and I mean, I, I was, I, I've done amazing considering what I didn't have, and I just was weary and feeling inadequate. And that's why I left my life in the first place, the great life, supposedly, where I was mostly housebound, stressed, um, overweight, depressed, and, uh, but very successful, according to culture. And I was dying. I finally got one of these so I can go wrap it around a pole outside and get some more full body shots or, you know, wide view. <laughs> well, it sure is delicious. I've put on a couple pounds. That's okay. I'm wearing black, so it's hard to tell. But my, but you know, my face always shows it. It's every pound was delicious. So it's easy for me to take it off. I don't have any trouble really losing weight. I don't really let it get more than a couple pounds. Scoop the frick out of it. <laughs> okay, can you not swear while I'm taping? I did not have that I on said camera. Frick. Oh, frick? Yeah, I'm just frick. frick. I controlled that F1. <laughs> Almost <laughs> lost my. This is this, you know what? This is gonna make you guys seasick, isn't it? Oh. I gotta move again.